Recycle precious metal to make jewelry. Everyone knows that we need to recycle as much as we can at some point. This means recycling items such as plastic bags, paper materials, and even bottles and chemicals. Lately, there is a trend in recycling even metal works into various pieces such as furniture or home decor. In this article you will learn how to recycle precious metal into pieces of jewelry that you can give as gifts or as pieces for yourself. If you are an expert then you can even sell this and make a living out of this. Follow the tips and suggestions below. Checking your metal source is the first step. First thing you need to do is to check the condition of the pieces of metal that you are planning to use. You of course do not want to use rusting metal or those that are really not meant to be worn by people. You can also check your jewelry box if there are pieces there that haven't been worn in such a long time or pieces that are currently not usable such as half a pair of earrings or a broken chain. Gathering your stocks If you are planning on selling your pieces of jewelry then make sure you have all of the items that you want to sell before you go to the nearest gold buyer. If you are planning to have them melted so that you can make a new item, then make sure, too that you have all of them ready. Choose pieces that do not have stones so that you can maximize the metal and not worry about pieces that you have to reuse. Putting same gold pieces together. You should also check the quality of gold, for example, of each item. Not all gold pieces are created equal. You must have heard of the carat ratings and if you are planning on melting your gold pieces, sort them out place all of your 18k, 14k, and 10k pieces together. Remove the stones, as well and check if there are pieces that have higher value such as items designed by a famous jewelry designer. For sure you do not want to melt those and probably you can just have them repaired. Knowing your end goal With any design project, you must know how much you are aiming for so that you know how much metal you need to recycle. Are you making a ring? Or a pair of earrings? Naturally earrings need the least amount of metal. The same thing for anklets or bracelets. Of course this all depends on the design that you want but that is the general rule. Also check if you want new stones to be incorporated in your recycled piece. If you are making a ring, make sure you have the right size ready so that they can estimate how much recycled metal will be used and how much new material you need to buy recycling precious metal is a fun way to create your own jewelry at the fraction of the cost of a brand new one 
Most jewelry can be recycled and if you invested in good quality pieces then recycling them should not affect the quality of the new item.